the CDC strengthens its recommendations as well as expands eligibility for COVID-19 booster shots. Following today's meeting of the Advisory Committee on Immunization Practices, also known as ACIP, the CDC has announced it will be expanding eligibility of COVID-19 vaccine booster doses to everyone ages five years of age and older. The CDC now recommends that children ages five years of age through 11 years old should receive a booster shot five months after their initial Pfizer vaccine series. Since the pandemic began, more than 4.8 million children ages 5 through 11 years old have been diagnosed with COVID-19. 15,000 have been hospitalized and tragically over 180 have died. As cases increase across the country, a booster dose will safely help restore as well as enhance protection against severe disease. In addition, today the CDC has announced it will be strengthening its recommendation that those ages 12 years of age and older who are immunocompromised and those 50 years of age and older should receive a second booster dose at least four months after their first booster dose. Over the past month, we have seen steady increase in cases with a steep and substantial increase in hospitalization for older Americans. While older Americans have the highest coverage of any age group of first booster doses, most older Americans received their last dose, either from their primary series or their first booster dose, many months ago. Leaving many who are vulnerable without the protection that they may need to prevent severe disease, hospitalization, as well as death. Whether it is your first booster or your second, if you haven't had a vaccine dose since the beginning of December of 2021, and you are eligible, now is the time to get one. The following comment is from the CDC director, Dr. Rochelle P. Walensky. She said, today I endorsed ACIP's vote to expand eligibility for COVID-19 vaccine booster doses. Children ages five through 11 years old should receive a booster dose at least five months after their primary series. Vaccination with a primary series among this age group has lagged behind other age groups, leaving them vulnerable to serious illness.
with over 18 million doses administered in this age group, we know that these vaccines are safe and we must continue to increase the number of children who are protected. I encourage parents to keep their children up to date with the CDC's COVID-19 vaccine recommendations. With cases increasing, it is important that all people have the protection that they need. Which is why, today, the CDC has also strengthened another booster recommendation. Those ages 50 and older and those who are 12 and older who are immunocompromised should get a second booster dose. 